There she goes. First your money and then your clothes. I'll tell you, that is a smooth runner. That is a smooth runner. Wow. Let's turn some lights on over here so you can see a little more. See if we can see it coming through. That is a smooth alcohol. Unbelievable. Unbelievable. I have to find a soundboard. I just have to. This needs sound. Nine volts. Eleven volts. I mean it's not digitally controlled. It's it's a uh, it's AC to DC just going in. All right, let's come out of the tunnel and hit the gas, see what he does. Oh, oh! now he's making some noise. Now he's making some noise. He, he can handle it. He can handle it. Wow, is that nice. Stop. Reverse. I have switches on my transformer for that. See it, 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 oh, I know what it is. I have a circuit protector that doesn't even turn on until 9 volts. That's the deal. Yeah, I'd have to bypass that because it's made for digital control. Okay, well, I think... I think it's time to think about... The cars that I'm going to pull with this, I'm not going to pull these heavyweights, and um, and a and a control and a soundboard. I think a soundboard would be awesome. Okay, I'll post this. You guys can see it. Um, I'm not going to show you what's inside. You saw it already in the other videos. If you forget, go look. This is a 19 November 1950 Alco. Um, 360 361 matching shells. Uh, this is nothing but a Lionel digital control board. It takes AC, gives you two lines of DC for the two DC CAN motors that are inside here. The chassis of this 360 is an uh, American Models Alco chassis. It's cast metal, two big DC motors with three flywheels. And I just put an old headlight I had laying around, just stuck something in there for a light. Um, but I had to do some adapting. I had to grind the, the chassis and I had to build some adapters uh, to bolt the chassis in. But by golly, look at that. That's, that's pretty darn nice. So, I don't know. I'm going to see what I can do with this. This is, this is pretty exciting. Pretty exciting. And it'll scoot. Those American models are darn good runners. Look at that, that's flat out. And it's just sticking to it. Sticking like it's on rails. And when I shut her down, it takes about a foot, foot and a half to coast to a stop. I like it. I like it a lot. I'm going to have fun with this. Okay, I'll stop here. I'll post this tonight. We'll talk about it some more another day. Later.